this is gonna be a weird one. For two reasons, my ideal Gordon is not an LNAR A10. One, the idea of him being the prototype doesn't work. Great Northern was the prototype. That was one of the reasons there was such a fuss over his rebuild in 1945. By the way, I'm aware that Simon Martin has debunked a lot of information about the reason behind this decision, but this doesn't detract from the historical significance of Great Northern. Two, and more importantly, I don't wish to take Flying Scotsman's status as the sole surviving A-10 away from him. My ideal Gordon is still an LNER Pacific, a Raven A-2. And for the first time on this program, I have a specific basis for him. Number 2404, City of Ripon, built in 1924 and rebuilt in 1929 with a modified A-10 boiler or A1 as it was known at the time. This way he can still have a kinship with Flying Scott, so his eventual visit is still a boon, and aesthetically he doesn't need that many changes. As an A2, he's in the same post-steam days boat as Flying Scott, Blue Peter, and at a push, Tornado, leaving the A4 as the odd one out. City of Ripon was withdrawn in 1937, so my fanon is he was sold to Sodor and rebuilt at Crew, so he can keep the oval buffers, larger cylinders, outside exhaust pipes, and center driving wheels. And upon arrival on Sodor, he's introduced as City of Ripon, and someone asks if they can call him Kor, C-O-R, for short. At some point, someone else mishears Kor and thinks his name's Gordon. The engine liked it, so when Sir Tom had eventually bought the railway from BR, the name stuck. I'm sure I'll get to my ideal Sodor railway system in history someday. If you liked hearing my point of view and seeing my edits, leave a comment saying which character you'd like me to cover next. 